Alright guys, it's been a little while, our motherboard on another computer went out. So here we are. You can kind of see what's going on. I got three screens set up. The far right screen is what you're seeing as the background in front of me and to my left are both screens basically just putting out white light. Anyways, on your left you can see that we're using a C920 with TriDef which basically uh, for XSplit or any other program is $9.99 for uh, a full years of service obviously you can see it does background removal you can see as I move around my fingertips you know you can see the black areas between my fingers you can also see the the area on the right which is our razor star grazer obviously the razor doesn't pick up all the extra light you can see the difference between the two cameras I haven't adjusted them that's the basic install of default with the tri-definition program on the C920. The, the Razer, however, it is what it is. I mean, this is... Eh, it, if you look at the blurriness around my fingers and stuff, the uh, the Stargazer is much faster. Um, if you looked at our other video, which I'm sorry, it came from a cell phone. I didn't have an actual fully functional motherboard on my other system because the USB 3.0s were out. We're trying to do a BIOS flash and well it went corrupt so they want the motherboard anyhow so we got that problem fixed and i was just showing you the difference yes the laptop that was running the um, the stargazer does not run it that well but it would run it and it was an i3 i want to say it's like a 30 3200 i don't know it's a mobile anyways it's a laptop so you can see on the other video there was a bunch of little glitter. This processor here is a 6900. You know, it's a fifth generation. Um, not really a sixth generation. It's not a Skylake. Anyways, I don't believe you absolutely, as you can see, this is a fifth generation processor. You don't have to have a sixth generation processor to run this camera. And it can do decent. It also requires a little bit more light, but you can see my face and everything. Everything's much more realistic looking, better tense. It doesn't make me look as pale. Still bald no matter what, you know. But anyways, that's the difference. You're looking at, um, you can do a C920. You don't have to have the Stargazer. The C920 with Tridef will work just as good. I can tune down some of the light. You can see there's blotches in the back on the Tridef. It's starting to pick up. If if I if my kids turn on lights behind me, because I'm out in the middle of a room, watch I can fade out. You can see the difference. It doesn't pick up real fast. It's slow. Now the other program you can see right there with the Stargazer is much faster. It does require a lot more CPU usage than the C920, but just letting you guys go. You have a little bit of light. This is one screen giving my light off this side you can see it's not it is looks bright on the camera but you don't have to have an expensive camera you can do a c920 with the tri definition it works just fine and you don't need no background i mean i can turn the light on i'm in a room that's 15 foot by 28 foot long and i'm at one edge of the room you can see all the way across however right now you can't Anyways, thanks for hanging out. Appreciate your time. Stop by uh, Twitch.tv, MMO Legion. We'll have both cameras on display. We'll talk to you later.